Uh, what is up everyone welcome back to a new video today i'm going to be showing you the best item drop method and kind of the best diamond method in today's video now it, it's half and half pay to win and non pay to win because as you can see i don't have the premium slots but i do have some expensive kind of enchants so i guess you could say it's pay to win and not pay to win because i mean yeah you kind of got to be rich to get these but I do know other ways you can do it. Um, so first of all, what you want to have is just a full team of good pets. To be honest with you, I just have like half of my team are just huges. Are like, um, or you could maybe have like a full team of these snowman things. I can give some of these away if anyone wants them. Um, or even better if you could have these prototype things because these are worth two million each right now. People are trying to buy them. Um, I don't know why they've went up. I, because, I I don't know, maybe just people aren't hatching that much anymore. Um, I also got a huge mermaid cat the other day. I don't know why I had to say that. I just, I did. last night, I mean. <coughs> but, um, yes, yeah, so you want a full team of them. Enchant-wise, look, so if you do enough damage, you want three of these treasure hunters. And then you you brought like either like comet, chess mimic, boss, or like you know like party time or whatever. You need something like good for these, like something that I like these, like big co massive comet. You know, um, what's it called? Uh, yeah, not super shiny. Um, I forgot what it's called. What's the other thing? Oh yeah, lucky block, lucky block. You could have lucky block just something here if not and if you don't feel like you guys don't do enough damage you could go for criticals and then you want to put make sure you have boosts on try get the best boost you can possibly possibly get because overnight in six hours i managed to get forty-five thousand drops just all because of boost pretty much and a good end chance you don't necessarily need chest mimic but or like boss chest but you i think you get a quite a lot from them so you want to make sure you put in your fruits your tennis ball things and uh hold on let me turn this down all right so yeah you want to put your toy bones on you want to put these on oh make sure you've got all your fruits on hold on um yeah yeah all right there's them and um yeah you just need your portions on and i guess you just start farming um i'd probably recommend putting on some speed portions as well and as you can see i'm making lots of diamonds i don't think the super drops pass affects diamonds i don't think it does i know it certainly affects drops so if you have the super drops pass you will have like a times three more drop rate or like a times five more i'm not sure but you get a lot more if you have super drops it's super worth it but if you don't you're still going to be getting a substantial amount of drops and possibly up to like like a few millions overnight personally i make about 10 million 12 million overnight like six hours or so so i get quite a bit and in a day i can afford about two to three huges from all the items and the gems maybe even four um but yeah, that's pretty much about it. Now, I want to show you guys with my loadout what it's like. So, if we put the boss and the chest mimic on. I guess we just wait for the, the must spawn. Um, while I'm doing that, I, I need to tell you guys, please use these lucky blocks. These lucky blocks are very worth it right now. They are worth like 5k, so they're worth basically practically nothing. And look at the good drops you get from this. You easily make 5k up with these drops. You can easily make profit from these. Sometimes you can even get like crit 7s, you know, like enchant 7s and enchant 8s. Uh, maybe not enchant 8s, but I've gotten a few enchant 7s from literally just using these lucky blocks. And you can make a lot of profit from this. Um, Yeah. Hold on. I still haven't spawned a chest mimic yet. Also, I do have a full team of of huges with the TNT enchants. So if you do want to, you know, it will help you if you do have these TNT enchants on your pets. Because 
I and I've I have noticed a big difference in breakables and I spawn like TNT pretty fast and you can keep seeing like the random explosions. Yeah, and that's from the TNT of course. Um yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video. If you did enjoy, I guess like the video. You don't have to, but sure, right, bye bye.